Hello and welcome to this Axiom demo. Today we're going to be taking a look at two tools, the Freehand Draw Tool and the Sculpt Draw Tool. The Freehand Draw Tool is perhaps the simplest tool in all of Axiom. It just lets you paint spheres or cubes or octahedrons. Here I can show you all three of them. This is similar to what you would do with a mod like uh, Voxel Sniper, for example. Very, very simple, I would generally not recommend using this tool over the other drawing tools, uh, but it is there if you want to use it. Next up we have Sculpt Draw Tool, which is a little more interesting. Uh, the way Sculpt Draw works is it essentially brings out the terrain. So uh, you can see if I go on the edge over here, you can see that it's bringing out the terrain here based on the normal of the terrain. So you can use this to sculpt away at the terrain. So now I'm not very good at sculpting, but I can give you a, a slight demo of what it looks like. Uh, if we go over here and we want to bring out this, we can, you know, we can sculpt away at this, bring it out a little bit, this mountain. Uh, you know, might want to bring out this part of the mountain over here. May want to bring out this part. You know, maybe want to uh, accentuate this. Want to bring out the top. We can do like that. Uh, of course, usually once you use this tool, you uh, want to go over it with the smooth tool, uh, which has its own video. Uh, but the result of the sculpt draw tool can generally be pretty rough. So going over it with the smooth tool afterwards is typically a good idea. As for the options, we have the radius. You can use this too. As it might suggest, adjust the radius. We also have strength. So the strength allows you to change the amount uh, by which the terrain is pulled outwards. So if this is low, uh, the terrain doesn't get pulled out a lot, which is what I would recommend if you're just trying to sort of uh, gradually adjust uh, one of your builds. However, if you want to, you can increase this. You can even increase it beyond one. Uh, at a level of five, it looks something like this, which looks <laughs> a little bit crazy. Uh, but you know, if you wanted to create some spikes or something, you can use this uh, this tool to do so, something like that. Uh, we also have Mask Y. Mask Y essentially will uh, make it so that it pretty much sculpts upwards. So you can see when I use it here, it's it's pretty much sculpting upwards. Now, typically, you'd again want to use this with a relatively low strength, uh, but this can be useful if you're just trying to sort of like bring up uh, a mountain here. You want to raise up a particular area. Uh, it can be useful to use the sculpt draw tool to do so. You see I just created this sort of ridge across here very, very easily. Unless there's denoise, you pretty much never want to turn this off. It essentially just applies a very small amount of blur, uh, which makes it the final result look a lot, lot better. Uh, and that's the freehand draw and the sculpt draw tool. If you want to see the other tools in Axiom, please check out the other videos on this channel.